I'm back and um, welcome to my channel if you haven't been before. Welcome back if you if you're new. Sorry about the sound. It's um, it's really windy. I'm out with there she is, Ember. She's just grazing in the round pen. Um, it's rather chilly. Happy Easter to everyone. It's Easter Monday. Um, yeah. So. Those of you who follow me on Instagram will know that the other day, um, it was Thursday, I had a great ride on Wednesday, Thursday came up and her front right knee was swollen um, all the way down her leg on the outside. So I had to contact the vet, no sorry it wasn't Thursday, it was Friday. Um, was Friday. And so she's been inside due to the you know, mud and whatnot we didn't want her to injure herself more so she's been inside I've been wa hand walking her and cold hosing and letting her graze there she is um, I'll insert a couple of photos of what her good leg looks like or looked like and what the swollen one the sore one looks like I've never had to treat a knee injury before, but of course, my mare has to go and injure herself, of course, because, you know, we're just a year past um, her breaking her splint bone and having the minor suspensory tear in that right hind. Yeah, so there she is. She's feeling, to, I'll get, today's Monday and it's like, I don't know, it's after three. Um, she's feeling good. She, uh, I'll, I'll insert a video, a short video, 20 second video I got of her rolling and um, bouncing. Yeah, I'm not used to holding the, the camera like this, the, my phone. Um, yeah, so I'm just trying to face the sun. And yeah, I'm trying to get an angle. I haven't done it like this before, so I'm sorry. Still working on things and I didn't bring my um, tripod. Anyway, there's the round sand ring behind me. Um, yeah, so knee injuries. I've never had to treat knee injuries before. This is all new to me, but you know, such is life. And so I don't know what my vet has me doing is just hand walking her or having her confined so she can just walk and try to get that swelling down and cold hosing and lots, lot, well, lots and lots and lots and lots and lots of cold hosing. Sorry. Um, yeah, I just bought some stuff and uh, today from the Healthy Planet, the health food store. It's got Arnica, it's an Arnica cream, but it also has MSM in it. It's human stuff, but I figure it's got Arnica and I like Arnica. It's good for swelling and bruising and sore joints and whatnot. So. It works for humans, it should work, shall work for said horse who's <laughs> feeling her oats right now. I guess it's the, it's the cold and it's the wind and she, she didn't get out yesterday because it was Easter and I came up quickly, hand walked her, cold hosed her and put her away. So anyway, that's, that's her right now. I'll try to get some more footage. I'm just going to let her sit 
out here and graze on some nice spring grass for a little bit while they're doing turn in and then I'll pick her up, cold hose her and give her her hay cubes and her equalizer and yeah. so, if any of you have had to deal with knee injuries with your horse comment down below on what you've had to do what happened I'd love to hear it um, yeah don't forget to share like subscribe share 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 um, yeah and happy Easter everyone I'll I'll see you in the next clip. Ciao.